guys welcome back to my channel and welcome back to another video if you're new here my name is treasure hansen in this channel i create content surrounding fashion beauty and lifestyle so if you like the sound of that i will really appreciate it if you go ahead and click on the subscribe button down below and subscribe join the family and i really do hope that you like it here as for you my old and returning subscribers thank you guys so much for watching for always coming back for supporting your girl i really really do appreciate you guys so yeah thank you guys so much all right guys today's video is going to be all about my winter coat collection the weather is dropping winter is slowly crawling in especially in this part of the country that i live in and as much as i hate winter the only thing that makes me look forward to it is the fact that i'm going to get the chance to bring out my coat and rock them in the winter season and i just love the vibe i love the layering i love the coziness and uh, yeah like i said that is the only thing that makes me look forward to winter so yeah i just decided to share with you guys my winter coat collection today perhaps you are in the market for a new coat or you're starting to build your collection i hope this video is useful i hope you find something that you like and i really hope that you enjoy this video as well so yeah without talking too much let's just dive right straight into the video <laughs> guys so i have about 10 coats to show you guys today so i'm going to start with my transitioning coats like the coats i can wear now in the fall season and i can also transition them to the winter season meaning that they are not like the most heavier coat and then we are going to work our way up to the most heavier winter coat all right okay guys so the very first coat that i have to show you guys is this particular one right here this is a structured coat and is not very long so it's like um i would call this a mid-length and I picked this coat up from RW and Co. I love the fact that it has this um, lines going down. The lines are in like this creamy color and the two colors just go so well. Of course, they are neutrals. It has one button here in front here and it has pockets. If I'm to wear this particular coat in the winter season, I'll definitely have to wear like a more heavier sweater under for more layers because like I said, this one is not really heavy. It's very, very, very appropriate prepared for the fall season right now it keeps you warm but of course i can still wait in the winter season so yeah like i said i picked this coat up from rw and co i don't know if they still have this particular one right here but i'm going to make sure to check their website if i find this particular coat i'm going to leave it in the description box below if they don't i'm going to make sure to link something similar for you guys so this i have styled i think a couple of times i'm going to put the picture here for you guys to see what it looked like this coat can go with so many things in my wardrobe which is why i love it and also whenever i buy coat i tend to think about it like if i'll be able to wear it with so many of my outfits of course you guys know i love my neutral colors and that continues on even with when i buy my coat i try to stick to the neutral family as well that way i can have a lot of use out of it so yeah guys that is it for this particular coat right here the next coat that i have to show you guys is this one right here it's also not very heavy so as you guys can tell this this one also has patterns in them this one has three colors it has a light brown it has cream and it has black so that is what that looks like close up this one has three buttons it's almost the same length as the previous coat that i showed you guys i picked it up from suzy sheer i love this coat and once again it has that neutral palette it has a pocket right here i love structured coats because you can put on the most basic outfit ever and put on a structured coat and it's going to just elevate that outfit instantly so i love structured coat for that so yeah that is it for this particular one right here the third coat that i have to show you guys is this one right here this is a wool coat and this one is definitely definitely more heavier than the one i showed you guys so i would say this one is a winter coat proper because it's really heavy as you guys can tell i tend to have a thing for pattern coats this one has just two colors in it it has gray and white kind of like a double breasted coat and has this button seat and this one is a little bit longer than the first two that i showed you guys it's absolutely gorgeous this coat with an all white outfit is everything you, and once again it goes with so many things in my wardrobe as well i bought this particular coat from Evernew and i got it in a us 8 it has this pocket here and it has something that looks like a belt at the back this coat is very heavy 
very good quality if you have the budget for it and you are looking to get like a very good quality coat it's going to cost you a little bit but i'll suggest you check out ever new i can't really tell you guys how much i bought this coat because i took off the tag i love this coat and i cannot wait to rock it this season okay guys on to more of my longer coat is this particular one right here this is a cream color coat this coat is from rw and co you guys here's a tip for you if you are looking at buying coats you know i would say the best time to shop for coats is when they are selling out the winter stuff that is when they usually reduce the prices of coats and it's more affordable i like to buy my coat during those times the only thing is if you have a coat that you really love and want to get chances are it may be sold out by that time and also this christmas season as well like if you want to buy coat that is a good time or you just wait for when they are doing the sales like the winter sales it has these buttons going down it kind of wants to look like a trench coat but it's not trench i really don't know what to call this material here i love this little detailing it has here at the shoulder and it also has a belt it has a side pocket what i look for in a coat is a belt and pocket i love coat that has belt because you can definitely use the belt to cinch your waist in and it gives the coat more structure especially if it's like a very huge coat but of course it's not all coat that are going to have belt like the first three coats i showed you guys does not have belt so yeah so this coat right here it says here is 190 dollars for the original price but the sell tax is 119 dollars and i'm very sure i got something extra off of this i love this coat i love the color of course is cream and i cannot wait to rock this one as well you guys so yeah that is it for this particular coat right here okay guys the next coat that i have to show you guys if you are following me on instagram you may have seen this one in my previous reel my lighting is washing the color of this coat out unfortunately but this is a nude-ish kind of mauve color coat it features this beautiful big collar here and this is what the inside of this coat looks like it also has pockets it has this belt right here this particular coat i also got it from rw and co it's a long coat perfect for the winter of course it's very heavy it's a wool blend coat the original of this coat here it says 299 dollars and 90 cents so that was 300 dollars you guys this what the sell tag here says 170 dollars i'm sure i did not pay that for this coat as you guys can see i get a lot of my coats from out of yanko because they have good quality coats a little bit expensive but like i said i love to shop there when they are having sales if you have an out of yanko where you live that's one good place to shop coats from so yeah that is it for this particular coat right here guys on to the next coat that i have to show you guys is this brown coat right here this is my latest addition to my coat collection this coat i still don't believe the price that H&M is selling this coat for so if you're in the market for a brown coat I I don't know if it's sold out I haven't checked but I really do know that this coat is not going to last in H&M because of the quality and the price I got this coat in a medium and it was $70 I love the color I love the brown it has this lapel color it has side pockets it has belt and is long as well the length the everything that this coat has with the price is amazing so yeah this is my latest addition to my coat collection from H&M and I really love it. Okay guys, the next coat that I have to show you guys, which is probably my favorite coat in my collection, is this coat right here. Look at the color. I got this coat from Le Chateau. Unfortunately, Le Chateau is no longer in business. I read somewhere that they are coming back. I am really praying and hoping that they come back because I really love Le Chateau. I love the quality of their products. They are very, very high quality, a bit expensive, but of course you pay for what you get. I got this coat when they were closing out, their closing sale. This coat is stunning. Can you guys see the lining? It's so well made, very good quality. This is a wool coat, but for some reason, I am not sure what kind of wool this is because as far as I'm concerned, wool are always super heavy. This wool is very soft. It has black and it has um, cream. It has this pattern going on. It has three black buttons here where you can button it up if you want. It has a belt. I have seen something like this in Nordstrom. So I'm going to check if they still have it. I'm going to link it in the description box below or anything I find that is similar to this. I cannot remember exactly 
exactly how much I paid for it, but it was close to $200 or more and I do not regret it one bit because I love this coat and I will keep this coat forever. If possible, I will. <laughs> My next favorite coat that I have to show you guys, another pattern coat and the color combination, black and nude. Perfection. I got this coat from Melanie line if you know anything about melanie line you will know that that is one of the most expensive stores to shop in as far as i am concerned i'm not sure if you guys were able to see that the price of this coat was 430 dollars i bought this last christmas as well so i went in at least once a week to see if they were going to reduce the price on this coat that is how much i wanted this coat until one day when I went into the store, I saw that this coat was reduced to $150. You need to see the excitement. It's a wool coat. I got it in a size 8. It has belt. This one has a front pocket. So instead of the pocket being on the side, it has it in front. I am going to try to keep this coat forever. I wish I had a girl child where I would pass this coat on to. But yeah, I will keep this coat for as long as I can keep it because I absolutely treasure this coat right here. I'm going to check if I find it. I'll leave the um, link, of course, for you guys in the description bar below. Nice. Second to the last coat that I have to show you guys in this video today is just a basic black coat. If you're starting out with building your coat collection, black coat is a very good place to start because of course it's black, it's going to go with everything that you have and then you can just build your collection up from there. I also did purchase this coat from Le Chateau as well during the sale. It has buttons and it has a belt. The quality of this particular coat here cannot be compared to the first pattern coat that I showed you guys. It's a wool blend coat. The price that it has here says, $250. I didn't pay $250 for this coat. No, I did not. It's really heavy. It's going to keep you warm. My hand is even hurting from holding it up. But yeah, this is a proper winter coat because it's really heavy. So yeah, this is this one right here. All right, guys. On to the very last coat that I have to show you guys in this video. And it's this puffer beauty right here. I got this one here from RW & Co. So this one has the zipper Thing, kind of like a half thing inside and this one has the zipper where you can zip it up and leave this part open it has fasteners here where you can close the whole thing up it has a hoodie the pocket kind of looks like a blanket it's very soft and the pocket has zipper where you can zip it up it has this material here that is like um elastic they have a black version of this coat and i decided to go with this one this coat was 300 dollars and i got 30 percent off in stock it's really expensive this thing is like wearing a duvet it's really 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 warm that is it for this whole one right here i really love it i love it i haven't worn it out yet because um we haven't really had any serious snow yet but i cannot wait to rock it yeah that is it for this puffer right here if you are interested i'm going to leave the link to this particular one right here in the description box below so yeah and there you have it guys that is it for my winter coat collection i absolutely i am in love with my collection i'm going to try as much as possible to leave the link to all of these items that i've showed you guys today in the description box below if i cannot find the exact item i would look for something similar for you guys so yeah i hope you guys enjoyed this video let me know which of this coat is your favorite as always please do not forget to give this video a like a thumbs up is very very important and thank you guys so much for always watching and supporting i really do appreciate you guys god bless you and i will see you in my next one bye